What's up ladies and gentlemen, this is the LNJ Shave Crate. We're back at it again after damn near a month. I've been out of the game because I've been real busy with my new job, getting orientated and getting used to the whole workflow out there, you know what I'm saying? But we're back at it and this is a long overdue shave with the brand new Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Shave Chaser. Alright, we're going to get right into it as quick as we can. This is That's an homage to skin bracer and I found the you know your basic skin bracer in a plastic bottle this is like I guess today's age but I think they're not gonna sell this anymore so I managed to cop one to go along with the, the new shave chaser combo I got going and this is the shave chaser splash so you can see it's got that green to it so to combine the shave we're gonna be using this by chisel and hound his egg brush. This is the second one that I own. The other one is pink. This one is dope blue and green and I think it goes well with the whole theme I got going right now. So I'm gonna scoop out some out of this tub right here. As you can see I'm already about to get some out. Boom, that should be more than enough. And along those lines of scooping soap out and putting it into your lather bowl, there's a reason for that. I didn't know about this until just recently. Um, apparently if you do it straight out of the tub, in due time, the scent will dissipate. It'll kind of disappear on itself. Because I'm guessing as you keep um, tub lathering, you're going to keep introducing water and it's going to keep like basically getting wet, getting dry, getting wet, getting dry. And I believe that basically waters down all the ingredients to the bottom of the tub, which is what I'm guessing. But it's also something I did not know because I would I would do a tub leather as well. Tub leathering is very common um, in the uh, wet shaving world. But because I want to hold the scent to my CK6 formula soap, I'd rather just dig some out and put it in here. The Lancaster Razor Works. Uh, I forget what this one's called. But it's medieval as hell. I love it. <laughs> so we're going to do that today. We're going to bowl leather instead of uh, out of the tub. Okay, and then we're going to be putting this right here in my new Rad Coffee espresso cup. It just so happens to be the perfect size for the knot. And it fits perfectly, as you can see. It looks kind of gnarly too. And thank you, Rad Coffee. I'm not trying to promote them as I'm not sponsored by them or anything, but they just got some gnarly ass shit. And Lucy over there loves Rad Coffee, right babe? She's too busy, as you can hear, blasting people in the background. So let's let that soak for a quick minute, and let's get to the shave. Okay. Let's get to it quick. It should happen pretty quick, because this is my second time around with Shave Chaser. I did a, a shave off camera with it, and I fell in love with the, with the CK6 formula, and... Or I should just say the soap itself. It just it lathers quick. It doesn't even need a lot of water. I mean, if you want more water just to make it more uh, shiny, put some more. And that's what I'm going to do. i use this little cup here. And we're going to make that lather. As you guys can see, I haven't shaved in about a month. So, this is a well-needed shave. And I'm debating on getting rid of the soul patch on the goatee if the wife lets me because she seems to like it. I don't really like it, but the wife always wins these battles. For those of you that have girlfriends and or married, you guys know the struggle. You guys can see there. Look at that. Instant. What are you saying about it? <laughs> yeah, she'll eavesdrop when she hears things like that. Well, what I'm saying is, is that if you let me, I'm going to shave my goatee and my soul patch unless you say otherwise because I can't win that battle, ladies oh. and gents. Oh, shit. And that's her answer. <laughs> and I'll be right back for the pre-shave. And we're back with the face wet with the Evil Cube pre-shave by PAA. Ladies and gents, if you guys do not use pre-shave either on your face or your legs, I recommend it highly. It really does help the shave 
all the way through. Less irritation or none at all. And I didn't mention what razor I will be using. I really rarely use this one because I love it so much. But it's a nice piece of hardware that I'm going to be using today. And that is going to be the Rock and Roll Sailor 2020. 2022 by Bull Goose Shaving. It is made in Turkey, but it's one hell of a shaver. If I would have known about the Rock Knoll early on in wet shaving, that would probably have been my only razor, as it is the best I've come across. But luckily I didn't, and then I went down the rabbit hole deep. Because now I'm looking for a Gillette Fat Boy bottom dial. If you guys don't know about the bottom dial, the last one just sold for about 2500 bucks that's just ridiculous it was on youtube uh no sorry ebay but yes i am on the hunt for a bottom dial uh razor emporium has a, a very informative video on that particular razor so you guys should check out razor emporium's youtube channel uh matt Pisarsic, obviously all right so let's get to it all right, as you guys can see, the shiny ladder right out the gate. It is not dry whatsoever. It's actually very shiny. I love this brush. I don't have a lot of brushes. I think I have a lot more razors than brushes, which is totally cool. <laughs> But I will, up, I will up my game in the brushes. You guys will see. I'll have some gnarlier things. So here it is with the second use feather in it on its max setting of five. We'll go with five. <laughs> I don't know Roman numerals that well. Oh, every time. Knocks it clean off. And for this razor, I had to get out of the out of the display case. It's like I tell you guys, I normally don't use this one. I'm pretty sure you guys already know what the cost of this one is. I may not have to reiterate that. We'll just say the wife almost killed me. <laughs> and at my new job now, I love it. It's in, it's nothing that I've ever seen before or, or have had. In the past this is a definitive upgrade to what i've had in the previous years and i'll tell you guys i've been driving for 11 years and it was a struggle i won't lie but that was my own fault But now, things have completely turned around 180, and uh, I'm doing much, much better in my career. I definitely enjoy going to work every day, and uh, I have a really awesome dispatcher and co-dispatcher. Uh, they're both ladies, and honestly, I prefer lady dispatchers or uh, logistics coordinators over males because they're a lot more nicer. I hate to straight say it like that, but they're, the ladies are a lot more caring, and they know what it is and what's up. You know, they, they bother to, to check the situations, you know, out there on the road, because they know. I can't really disclose much of what I'm doing right now at work, but I'll just let you guys know. It's the best I've ever had. And it will allow me to do a lot more things in life now, like invest. Um, start saving more.
and start getting ready to buy a second property. Which is something I'm looking forward to. My wife is definitely looking forward to that. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna wash the face real quick and I'll be right back. And we're back with the second pass. I did add a little more water because it does help a lot with CK6 formulas. They're very thick and they're very, very shiny. They have a lot of, a lot of sheen to them. Okay. Oh yeah, instantly. Look at this, it's like freaking ice cream. So, let's get to the second pass. Oh, every time. Second pass is always the best pass. The scent strength is a straight up five out of five. It's delicious, it's intoxicating. It makes you want to use it more and more and more. This is by far one of the ones I don't think I could live without. And some good news is the wife let me purchase Razor Emporium's, the, uh, what is it, the Rex console, the slant adjustable. And I can't wait to get that one. Because my beard grows very awkwardly under my chin. And that is a problem area as it's always been for me. But I think with this new razor with the slant adjustable, I'll be able to get under there with no irritation and no shredding. And this is the uh, midweek shave. And I needed it because I haven't shaved in a long time. Although Lucy loves it, I can't. I feel kind of bummy, not so clean. I don't know if you guys understand. Maybe some of y'all do. But I like feeling really clean, squeaky clean if possible. Plus I'm a truck driver, I don't think I look so hot with a huge beard and driving a truck. Truck driver's already got a bad, bad rap, you know? Terrible stereotyping. But it is what it is. This razor is a killer. It's one of the best and I can recommend it. There it is ladies and gents. The Wednesday Shave with Phoenix Artist and Accoutrements Shave Chaser. If you guys haven't already watched Ken Surf's videos, he's got two on Shave Chaser, and they're gnarly. The proof is in the chase, as you guys can see. I got the closest shave possible with that Rocknell 2022. That, that's why I don't really use it, because it's one of my prized razors. But honestly, check it out, ladies and gents. Look at that. It's killer. Thank you guys for watching. Please come again. This has been the LNJ Shave Crave. You guys know what to do. Leave your comments down below and uh, subscribe, like, and or dislike. And I'll be trying to get back to you guys as quick as I can with those comments that you guys are leaving behind now. And thank you guys again for the new subscribers. That's much appreciated. Um, uh, Lord knows this is a hobby that I enjoy and I love and it's going to be the same for me until I get old. This is not about money. This is about the love of wet shaving all right for those addicted click on my channel i got a lot of cool stuff coming up this is just a little fraction of what i got coming up the next one will be on i'll show you guys razor emporiums barbershop i'll be doing this sample with uh, the rex console so when that gets here that's the next shave so before i click off we're going to be doing the splash because i didn't forget Put some in the hand. I really like the PAA uh, reducer here. Really helps a lot. 
Oh shit. Excuse my language. <coughs> oh my eyes. Oh, I didn't even get it there, but whoa. Yes, I'm going for seconds. I want to smell bomb today. Oh yeah, oh yeah, definitely recommend Shave Chaser. Check it out on PAA. This has been the LNJ Shave Crepe. Shui J, out.